Hey everyone, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to preview and purchase motions for your iClone character or to export to your external characters. This is the 3DX portal and you can see that there are a number of motions and motion categories listed on the left. There are literally thousands of motions but I'm going to preview a couple of dance motions first. You can click the little play button on the image thumbnail to get a preview of the motion. If you want to quickly check out the next motion in line, just use the arrows on the side of the video window to skip to the next motion. Below the thumbnail, you can see a few options to either add the item to your wishlist, download a trial version of it, preview it in 3D Exchange, or add it to your shopping cart. Let's go to a new category of motions to check out how to preview motions in 3D Exchange. Here are some melee motions that could be useful if you were doing some kind of superhero movie that maybe had a big green monster sort of character who was maybe just a little misunderstood. Now what if I want to preview those motions on a character I already have? Well let's start by clicking the Preview in 3D Exchange button. What that will do is download a preview copy of the motion. In Chrome I can simply click on the downloader file once it's finished and you will see 3D Exchange open. But since there is no character there yet, a white default model that kind of looks like Chuck's ghost will appear. This is just the default test model when you haven't selected one yet. But now you can see the motion on a G5 default character. Also, notice that the motion is pink in the motion library, which simply means it's trial content and hasn't been purchased yet. Okay, so I've just purchased Bernie from the Chuck and the Neighbors pack, who I have opened up in iClone. Let's bring him into 3D Exchange by selecting the Edit in 3D Exchange button. This will give you a prompt in 3D Exchange to decide whether or not to export the current content or simply replace the character. I'll just click Replace for now, and you'll see that all the motion will remain, but the Ghost Chuck will be replaced by Bernie now. I can simply double click on the motion, and you'll be able to see Bernie perform his version of the Hulk Smash. You'll see his hierarchy is also in black text, indicating that I have purchased the export license version of the character. Now when I try to add the motion to the Perform Editor, I'll be stopped because it's still trial content that I have yet to purchase. Once I select the motion, I then have the option to either purchase the eye content or export license version of the motion. Since I want to export this motion to other software later, I'll choose the export license version. You can see that the export license price is more expensive than the eye content price due to the ability to export it to other software with the right to use it royalty free in other projects. If I have previously purchased an eye content version and want to upgrade to an export license version, the price of the eye content version will be deducted from my total in the order confirmation screen. Once you've gone through all the ordering steps, you don't need to download the file again as basically the motion has now simply been registered to your account via the internet. In iClone, if you apply the original motion, it will have a watermark as it is a trial version. However, you can go up to the Project tab and then into the Modify panel to the right, and you'll find a button that will allow you to update all the trial content you have in your scene. Now in 3D Exchange again, I just need to press the F6 key to refresh the data, and you'll see my motion will turn from pink to black, meaning it's ready for export. From there, I can add it to the perform list and export it in FBX or BVH format. I'll choose FBX here and enter in a file name. I only want to export the animation itself in this case, so I'm going to select the Include Animation checkbox only. After that, just press OK and perform the export. As you can see, it's super easy to find motions in the marketplace and test them on your bone rig characters in 3D Exchange, so you can find the perfect motion to match your character, just like Bernie and the Hulk Smash.